Mfumo, part of the Birmingham coalition, as you all know, unfortunately endured an injury on the side of his face. We did see initially the swelling and then an abscess burst and of course then revealing the maggots. Now myasis is quite uncommon, especially to see it out here in the wild. Most of the cases have actually been recorded in captivity and then the vets have actually intervened. We have let nature take its course and we've let the entire process carry on. And well, it's ended up with great results because Mfumo is well doing well, mating with the females, catching buffalo, doesn't seem to be affected by it at all. It's amazing how these animals are able to push through and fight off bacterial infections and various diseases. And that's because they are so strong. They've been exposed to a variety of different elements from when they were just tiny. Every now and then we see a black scab forming over the surface of the skin. But unfortunately, because it is a scab, it's quite sensitive. When he wipes his face or if he rubs up against another female or marks his territory, he is going to remove that scab. It's going to take a while for it to heal, but eventually it will. The most important thing that there is no longer a gaping hole inside his face and that flesh has come together. But now we'll just wait until the final scab heals. We have got so much more to show you from the African bush. So I'll tell you what, why don't you click subscribe here, activate it with a little bell here, and you'll get a notification every time we go live. That's two, three hour safaris every single day.